Practitioners, we are back at the Calisthenics Park. I did a very simple training on that morning. I did one up chin up holds, top holds. <laughs> I thought I did five seconds, but when I look now at the video, it's only four. And then I did handstand push up eccentrics to see free balancing half range. I would call this because it's only to the ground, like it's not the full flexion of the elbows. And as you see, I'm holding the bottom position a bit before I disengage. Yeah, if I recall correctly, I did eight sets on that day and I'm also doing my leg work, of course. And here you see the long lunge position. Static position, usually held for something like 30 to 60 seconds. If you can hold longer, you can add weight. Okay, Carl and me, who's staying in Berlin, training with me, we just finished session at the park what we notice what is a bit interesting is that in this calisthenics parks everyone is mute like there's no talking everyone comes and there's no hello or goodbye then I mean so you can be proactive and say hello and goodbye but it will for most people will just or well, they will be super quiet the hello it will be like just a hand or just uh, uh, and everyone has their headphones and it's like you cannot even talk to anyone because they will not hear you. So it's a very interesting situation. Like it's very focused on the individual training, which um, is discussable because in a sense it's a, this is a third place, no? Like the idea of different places. You have home, first place, you have work, second place, and you have meeting places that's third place so the calisthenics gym is a third place but it is not a third place anymore if everyone is wearing headphones no one is talking to each other mariana met her boy boyfriend at a calisthenics park which would not be possible if you would um yeah not talk with each other like you can par find even a partner there for i mean it's not a hookup place or anything like this yeah but it's possible to find people there that at least if you go there regularly maybe you will see the same people and then you can share some thoughts about training or something like this i did this recently i had a nice talk with someone i had just like someone with muscle ups didn't wear headphones i just approached him and said hey are you doing more sets so i would join and uh, yeah then we did a few sets together of different exercises and um we talked about different things. He was from Albania, taught me, taught me a few things about Albania and stuff. So it was actually quite interesting. So that was nice. And the funny thing is that for me, like that I approach people, I'm not considering myself very like in need of socializing with strangers at this calisthenics park. But for me, it's still like, this is part of the thing. No, you meet there, you do the same thing. You talk a little bit with each other, like not so much that you cannot do the training, but yeah, it's a social place also, but it's unclear at the moment if it's a social place or not. It might not be, so maybe I'm mistaken with this. Guys, I let this just run here for a little bit. This is about harmonious joint practice. It was in the evening, two students joined me for this. So we were working with the floor. Have a look and then see you next time. Yeah. And automatically just from stiffening tiny bit, it's almost like I fall upwards. I fall back into the sitting position. Yeah? And now I'm falling back into the lying position. I did like this. If I liked it, I can do a few more times. So if I didn't like it, I can also do a few more times. Like, I show you an example of not all joints participating. If I do, for example, this, which you can do, but you see it was very much with the legs. Yeah? Obviously not wrong in general, just for the exercise. No? I would something like, more like, Yeah, also the head you saw was involved, like it was also moving. Here the 
so it is fine like and in all the joints there was movement now when I go back up I also search 